Let's expand the property tax rent rebate program for our seniors and for disabled Pennsylvanians. I see some things didn't change. Some people didn't know if they were supposed to stand up there or not. It's all right. Give me a chance. We'll keep working through this. You see, it gives a rebate to low-income renters and homeowners every single year, putting money back in their pockets so they can stay in their homes. Homes where seniors like Gaylene Makuska raised their families, lived their lives, and made memories over so many years. Thanks for being with us, Gaylene. Let me tell you about Gaylene. She's a mother, she's a grandmother, and she's a great-grandmother. She made the choice to start college at 43 after leaving an abusive marriage. She then went on to earn three different degrees. She's an active volunteer who loves to give back to her community in Scranton, and she's living with stage four breast cancer. Gaylene's life has been full of family, full of learning, and full of community. The property tax rent rebates have helped Gaylene stay in her home. But understand, it has been 17 years since Pennsylvania took a look at what seniors actually need to get by. 17 years since the formula that provides relief to people like Gaylene has actually been updated. I think it's time for the Commonwealth of Pennsylvania to catch up. And so my budget proposes a significant expansion in the property tax rent rebate. I want to raise the maximum rebate for seniors from $650 to $1,000. Hang on. And, and I want to increase the cap for renters and homeowners to $45,000 a year. Fi Finally, Finally, and this is important, I want to tie that cap to increases in the cost of living so that this Commonwealth never has to tell another senior, hey, sorry, you're out of luck because your Social Security payment went up, but we didn't act. Under my plan, nearly 175,000 more Pennsylvanians will qualify. And the 400,000 people who already qualify, people like Gaylene, will see their rebates nearly double. So in a nutshell, this would nearly double the number of seniors who qualify for relief, as well as the amount they receive to help them stay in their homes. I've heard... Listen, I've heard from lawmakers on both sides of the aisle who want to expand the property tax rent rebate because it helps seniors in every single county. 17,000 seniors in Westmoreland County, in fact. More than 14,000 in York and more than 11,000 in Lehigh counties alone. Gang, these are our neighbors. Let's get this done for them. It's what they deserve, and it's common sense. And it's not enough just to help seniors and the disabled stay in their homes. We also need to make sure that people living paycheck to paycheck can maintain their homes. I've directed the Department of Community and Economic Development under the leadership of Acting Secretary Rick Seiger to move swiftly to disperse the whole homes repair funds, get them out on the street right away. In fact, the first payments are expected to go out as early as next week, providing much needed help and comfort for our neighbors. I look forward to working with everyone in both chambers to support and grow this initiative for many years to come.